Hello everybody, it is I, Woozy Gamer 136 and welcome to part 5 of Pokemon Violet. Where we last left off, we finally reached the school. Man, look at this place. And this place is packed and got everyone's moving at different frames. Crazy. Come here. I think I'm hungry. Oh wow, look at this place. So I'm just checking out. I get bien! That basically means like, oh, that's pretty, or, oh, it looks good, basically. But anyway, uh, we basically have to go, go all the way up to that. Oh, wait, actually, no, you guys can see from all the way over here. Let me just go back a little bit. So you see that right there? See this giant school over there? Yeah, I have to climb that entire mountain. There's a lot of Pokemon. There's Swablu's. There's so many Pokemon here. But right now, I just want to explore the place a little bit. You know, just check it out. You know? There's a little Pachirisu over there. There's like a bunch of Pokemon. What, what's cute? I guess Pachirisu is adorable. They have their own Pokemon? Oh, cool. They have their own battle arena. That's awesome. Look at this place. It's so big. I gotta say, it's very nice. And I, if I had it, honestly, if a campus like this existed, I would, um... I would be so happy. But anyway, yeah. So right now, uh, we're just gonna go ahead. I'm right behind you, lady. Welcome to the Pokemon Center. Yes, I need you to heal my Pokemon. All right, this will only take a few seconds. All right, there we go. Thank you. And with that, my Pommy and everything else is ready. Uh, did you know I don't care? I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. This is the one thing I don't like. But like, after you heal a Pokemon, you have to listen to them. Like, you don't have a choice. I kind of find that very annoying, you know? And also, I hope that the mic audio is a little better than it was before. I kind of up updated, like, the audio. So, if it's a little loud, let me know. What do you think? I'll probably just lower it a little bit. There we go. So, it should be fine around here or maybe here. Yeah, this should be. Yeah, this should be fine. This should be fine. So, uh, yeah, as, um, as I was saying, I'm just gonna go on and, um, basically, go here. I'm just gonna climb up the stairs and, dear god, oh wait, what's this? Oh, that person's got an Eevee backpack! Oh, that's cute. Oh, uh, who are these? Don't you get it? If you join Team Star, you can shine as bright as anybody! Team Star? Seriously, what's up with you? Don't you want to burn bright with awesome friends like us? Not really. Look, we got a quota we're supposed to fill for new members, so just sign up already. Oh, they're bullies. Oh, is this anything like Team Skull? Um, I'd rather not. Help her out? Okay. What? You want in on this too? If you're here to sign up, we'll get you the next time. We've nearly got this one in the bag. We're Team Star Kid. We burn so bright, it hurts to look at us. But you knew that, right? Mm. No. Ugh, another ignorant little nobody. <laughs> here, I'm fine. Here, I'm finally part of Team Star, and still, I get no respect. I gotta work my way up the ranks. Hey, we can't let somebody, something like this slide. The honor of our team's on the line, and we got no choice but to battle. I feel like the, like, the organization's kind of dwindled after Team Sun, and then Team, uh, Team, uh, wait, who's the other thing? Team, Team, what was the other team? Team Noise, was it? I don't know. That's true. You keep watch on the on that little four on that little four eyes over there. Oh, that's mean. I'll make sure this fresh faced nobody ends up seeing stars. Oh. Fine, I'll battle, I don't care. Okay, that that's that's kinda cool. I'll give I'll give her credit for that. Oh, it's this Pokemon. All right, first off, I'll just start with something simple. Charge up. There we go, Pommy. You got, don't worry, Pommy, you're gonna be fine. You're gonna be fine. Your next attack's gonna be powerful. 
use charge. All right, good. Now it's storing up all that electricity, and it's defense increased too, so that's going to be helpful. And now to release its attack, that's going to use Leer. So, oh no, Leer's going to lower my defense. Oh no, it didn't lower my special defense. Okay, there we go. Now we're going to go ahead and see if Quick Attack does the trick. Uh, it doesn't. <coughs> that's okay. Oh! Come on, finish this off with Quick Attack. Come on. There we go. Yes! And it fainted. Awesome. And Quaxly leveled up. Along with uh, Fido. How come I'm... How come I'm the one seeing stars? Yeah! I'll be taking a lunch money. Why isn't nobody like you so good at battling anyway? That's just not right. Okay, so... No way he beat you? Does that mean I gotta battle this kid now since I'm a higher up Team Stars ranks? Pero bueno. What do you think you're doing? Mm, it's the student council dweeb. It's that student council dweeb. She's gonna report us if we don't book it. I can't believe you, Woozy. You don't have to go find randos to battle. You'll have to. You'll have all the battles you'll ever need with me. Oh, that's not. That's not really what happened. Oh, wait. They picked a fight with you. Wow. I really read this. Read that way wrong. Sorry. God. I get it now. You two have. Got Team Star written all over your face for sure. I bet you were trying to pressure people into signing up again, weren't you? Uh, hi. Uh, we were not doing that. Well, that explains it. As head of the student council, stopping this type of nonsense would would normally be my job. But this is a perfect time for you to try out an amazing, an ultra rare gift to you. You obtained the Terra Orb. You use this orb in a key item. Awesome. An orb within power to crystallize. Oh, sweet. I get to terrestrialize. So it's kind of like a Pokeball capsule. You know, like those little things you put on like, if you guys don't remember in like uh, Pokemon games, uh, like Diamond and Pearl, you could put like a little like case over your Pokeball. So that when you release them, it like turns all sparkly. Let's see. After it terrestrializes, I'm sure your Palmy will be an electric type. Normally, you've got to take special classes to be able to use one of these orbs, but I put in a good word for you. Now, time to give it a whirl. You'll learn as you go, so you use it faster in battle than if I had to explain it. Wait, what? You want this kid to practice wailing on us with his Terra Pokemon? Is that it? Got a problem? You want to battle me instead? Uh, never mind. I'll take my chances with this new kid. Then take your places and battle! I like how we just take a few steps back. I'm not gonna lie, I kinda like the way they set it up like that with the little stars. You're challenged by Team Star Grunt. Okay. Young Goose. Alright. Here in the Paldea region, Pokemon can crystallize through a strange phenomenon. The people call this terrestrializing. You can terrestrialize your Pokemon by selecting the terrestrialize button in battle. When a battle terrest when a Pokemon terrestrializes, its type changes to its Terra type. Moves of the same type of this Pokemon will become much more powerful than usual. Okay. Okay, I think I could do that. All right, let's go. Come on, terrestrialize, terrestrialize. Wonder what it's gonna look like. <laughs> Oh my god! Oh my god! Its hat is adorable! It's a little light bulb! That's clever. Whoa. Okay, I think it actually got a lot powerful. More powerful. Oh, wow. Come on, finish it off. There we go. And just like that, Young Goose has been defeated. And he leveled up. Your Pokemon burns so bright. Aww. I'm happy that my Pokemon got stronger.
Nice, Woozy. You pulled off Terrestrializing? No problem. Moves on your Pokemon's Terror type will hit even harder when it's Terrestrialized, you know? Sometimes you'll find a Pokemon whose ter Terror type is totally different from its usual type. That difference can open up a whole lot of strategic options. Gotta charge your Terror or by the Pokemon Center after every use by healing your po healing your team, though. Well, I'll be on my merry way then, yeah! Hasta la V-Star! Oh, that, oh. Uh, yeah, hasta la vista. It's it's actually hasta la vista, but like, um, they, they said star, so that's, that's actually clever. That's actually clever. So yeah, Team Star is basically a group of students that like to kick up trouble. They hardly ever show up to class, and when they get together in groups, they're a real headache. Even the teachers don't know what to do with them, from what I hear. Um, excuse me. I, uh, um, I just, well, thanks. So, yeah, see you around. I like her Eevee backpack. I want one. Aw, look at you, Uzi, already becoming a big hero around campus. I don't think I've seen that girl around. Maybe she's a new transfer, like you. That Eevee bag, though, love that fluff. It is adorable. Yes, I want the Eevee backpack. Anyway, seems like the troubles died down, so we better book it up to school. Get ready to climb the worst staircase in the world. Oh, yay. Stairs. My old enemy. Wait, how? how? Oh, my God. God. Oh, uh, gotta get those steps. Uh, 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 God. Wait, where did they show up? Okay. Uh, finally. I love it. Come on. Wow, look at this place. It's really huge. I like the crest. Alright, time for me to get going. I have no time to waste. I just want to get inside and just continue on because I just want to be able to collect my badges, try out this treasure hunt thing, and above all, just basically just see the rest of the region, man. Here we are, Woozy. Welcome to Uva Academy. Or Uva Academy. This here is the entrance hall. You can sign up for all kinds of classes on the desk behind me. And those halls off to the sides lead to different parts of the school. It's totally big enough to let loose the and battle in here. But for some reason, they ban Pokemon battling in the main entrance. Yeah, I would imagine. Because like there's like a lot of stuff and I'm pretty sure everything will get destroyed. Master Woozy and Miss Namona. How did you find your first school commute? A pain... It was a blast, I say sarcastically. It was a nightmare. I imagine Miss Nimona's high spirit helped with that. She's a true asset to our fine academy. Oh, Teacher's pet. Just kidding. Not that I was expecting any less from our champion ring student council president. Reliable as ever, Miss Nimona. Well, I know how to look after my friends. Right, Woozy? Oh, but speaking of which, we saw some of those Team Star kids in town, Director. You did? Where? It was down the stairs in the front gates. They were hassling this kid with an Eevee backpack. It was quite the news. Are they still to be found out there? Actually, Woozy flexed on them and ran off. Ran them off. You don't say. Of course, it's a fine thing to try and help a fellow student, Master Woozy. But you might wish to show a little bit of restraint as you... You find your feet here in, at our academy. And Mr. Mona, do remember that the school staff is here to resolve any such troubles. Uh, right. Yes, sir, Director. A child with an Eevee backpack, you say? I suppose that might have been Miss Penny. I'm relieved to hear she's come to class, at least. Oh, and Mr. Nomona, if you'd be so good, do report to Mr. Jacques uh, about this uh, Team Star business. As your homer teacher, ye should be kept apprised of all such ongoings. You got it, sir. Oh, but look at the time. You two had better hurry along. Classes will be starting soon. We're in class 1A, Woozy. Come on, I'll show you around. Wow. My first day of school. Oh my god, look at this guy. Good morning, Mr. Jacques. Where am I sitting? Where, where am I? 
Hello, hello everyone. I have some exciting news this morning. Who wants to hear it? Ooh, me, I want to hear the news. I suppose I should tell told you sooner, but we have a new little friend joining our happy homeroom as of today. Whisper, 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 Pikachu, whisper. I wonder what they'll be like. Alright, you can come on in. Hey, it's me. I'm the main character. What's up? Could I trouble you with three words and introduce yourself? Sure, I'm Uzi. Did you hear that? He seems super friendly and fun. Looks like everyone's eager to know you, Uzi. Alright then, who wants to be the first to ask our new friend a question? Oh, me, me, me. Can I ask a question? What's your favorite thing about Pokemon? I like battling, I like collecting them, I like playing, I like everything about I actually like everything about Pokemon. Really awesome! I'm totally the same! Does anyone else have a question for our new classmate? Me! I have a question! We went to all the trouble of a rolling here, so spill, Woozy. What do you hope to get out of it? You must have some kind of dream, right? I want to be a strong trainer. You will be, and I just know it. You and me, we're going to be so strong battling together. Well, thank you for telling us a bit about yourself, Woozy. I'm Mr. Shock. I teach biology here at the academy, and I'm also your homeroom teacher. That's your seat. Second row to the front. Man, I can't believe it. Alright, no. Alright, you ragamuffins. Be nice and friendly to our new classmate. We will, Mr. Jacques. Get to know the Academy campus by exploring it a bit on your own. Looking for Nimona, actually? We gotta call the staff room just now. Welcome to the Academy! Before- Thank you for answering my question earlier. Oh, no problem, man. When in class sessions, we tend to be in our best behavior, but our best still isn't that good. Yeah, it sounds about right for school. Yo, new kid! Glad you're- Glad to have you- Aw. Everyone's so nice! You wanna talk to- What? You wanna talk to me? And everyone's so- Everyone's so nice! Why is the school like this a lot? Why is it like that when I was growing up? When I was a new kid, I should discover something. Oh, whoa. Cafeteria? Uh, I guess cafeteria. Oh, actually, the cafeteria, because there's that guy there. Might as well check it out. See him there. Whoa. Yeah, chew first. Everything's better together. Sandwiches, you make taste better together than. Aww. It's this guy. Oh, it's you, so we meet again. You remember me, right? You're from the lighthouse. Yeah, exactly. That's my little know-it-all buddy. Got a mind like a steel trap, eh? No need to tell me your name. Lose you, right? Whole school seems to be talking about you. The new kid who showed up with the principal of the student council. I normally wouldn't bother showing up to class, but I came here on the way today to just, just talk with you, our new celebrity. You gotta help me out so I can finally make my dream a reality. What's this dream first? <laughs> Got your interest, have I? You wanna hear all about my dream, right? Well, this might come to surprise, but the fact is, I'm all about the picnic life. The great outdoors, the perfectly prepared sandwich, all of it. And I have bad at cooking either, I could tell you. Right now, I'm researching new recipes that will help Pokemon feel better. Real health food, you see. I found this book the other day, and it seems to have some section about these Herba Mystic uh, things. Basically, there are some kind of special herbs that heal up any Pokemon as soon as it eats them. Now, there are a total of five different types of Herba Mystics, based on what I read. Just taking a trip, just taking a lick of them once, They've been uh, powdered, will make your blood flowing, provide nutrients, prevent aging, will even boost the immune system. These herbs seem like they'll be a real deal, only found here in Paldea and rare to boot. <laughs> to boot. 
but this book says that they're all guarded by Titan Pokemon, meaning it's going to be pretty tough to try to grab even a few sprigs. Because, see, Titans are, well, I think they've got to be things like this. <gasps> Whoa! As we descend further into Area Zero, we begin to catch glimpses of mysterious Pokemon. Though we wonder if these compact, cruel beasts were indeed Pokemon at all. One of the teams suffered a brutal blow from such a beast and was mortally wounded, forcing us to retreat for a time. Ooh. And that Pokemon looks familiar. What? A member of the survey team captured this photo by chance. I noticed a passing resemblance of a Pokemon known as Donphan, yet dis differences such as its texture and the way it moves suggest it's a biological separate. To say nothing of its threads of iron. Ooh, that's cool! I wanted to get to get these herbs for myself, but I'm not very good at Pokemon battles. Don't have any friends with strong Pokemon to lend me a hand either. I've never heard the end of it, and I'd never hear the end of it if I went crawling to that student council girl. But here you waltz up, you gotta help. You'd be perfect. Okay. Sounds interesting. Nope, wait. I don't hear your answer yet. I'll just register the places where it seems like there will be Titans on your map for you. Oh my god, look at his phone case! False Dragon Titan, Quaking Earth Titan, Open Sky Titan, Lurking Steel Titan, Stony Cliff Titan. Okay, these are all the Titans. Path of Legends! Okay, that's interesting to know. <laughs> Let's spew a bit and get... And we can get more into the details later. And in the meantime, take this. A little gift for listening and all. A bag of stardust. Oh, sweet! Give the idea some serious thought, please! I, I just said yes, though. I, I just said yes, though. Oh, this guy rushes off fast. Wait, my phone's ringing. This is Aura! This is Woozy, correct? I hacked your smartphone so I could talk with you. Hope you don't mind. Wait, what do you mean hacked? Well, as far as you're concerned, it means I basically can control your phone right now. Man, Rotan, I'm so bad. I feel bad for My name's Casopia. But never mind that. It's you I want to talk about. I hear you're a trainer with serious potential. In the descriptions accurate, there's something I'd like to ask you. Tell me, Woozy. You know about Team Star, right? Yeah. Great, I appreciate you being up front here. Team Star is a group of troublemakers formed by some academy student a while back. They cause headaches for the students and try to bring other students to join down to their level. And I refuse to sit idly by and let them do let them get away with it. So I come up with a plan to bring down Team Star and force them to disband for good. I call it Operation Starfall. And I need allies to carry out this operation. And I'd like you to be one of them. Okay. No need to reply right this second. We can discuss the details some other time. Till then, I'll leave, it, I'll leave you to it. Bye. Why is everyone saying no? I have just said yes. Ah, oh, Master Woozy. Please do try to keep your voice down if you're making calls within the school, won't you? Of course, sir. Yes, sir. Gosh. Getting in trouble. You don't want anyone else overhearing any professional information, after all. Honestly, there are so many things we need to be careful about in this day and age. On you go, then, young man. Yes, sir. There's a, a weasel! Hmm. Who's star, you say? Hmm. Hmm. I don't get it. Seeing so like suspicious. Okay, so now I pretty much explored that. So now I just gotta check out one more place. Where do I want to go? Uh, I want to go to the staff room. Whoa, this is a staff room? Pretty big. Who's she talking to? 
Very well, Champion Nimona. I trust you to handle this in my stead. Sure thing, you can count on me! In fact, I bet this is gonna be fun! I'm glad to hear it. Good day, then. Oh, pardon me. Who is that? Oh, hey, Woozy! Who is that? Beat your interest, yeah? That lady? Well, her... They call her La Primera. She's strong. She can do pretty much anything. She's got cool practically coming out of her ear. She's basically everything. Or that any Pokemon trainer would want to be, really. Wait, what? Oh, which reminds me. Remember in Homeroom when I asked you what your dream is about? Dream is? Well, since your heart's already set on becoming a strong trainer, I got a good idea for you. You should try to reach champion rank like me. Yeah, I will. Oh, wow. Hang on, though. I got a whole spe spiel I want to give you. Here goes. The trainers who reach champion rank are ones who are raised their Pokemon really strong. They're pro-tier battlers. Their moves keep crowds absolutely on the edge of their seats. You have to prove yourself to be the Pokemon League to the Pokemon League to officially get the title of champion. Wait, 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 wait. You're saying she's champion? And to do that, you gotta be more do more than just take classes here. You gotta take on the eight Pokemon gyms and win so that way you can collect their gym badges. Once you've done all that, all that's left is the special test, the champion assessment. And once you pass that, then all, then at long last, you'll become a champion. It's every trainer's dream, the coolest title anyone can ever hope to get. But not only the brag. I reached champion rank during my last treasure hunt, you know. Oh, treasure hunt is a special independent thing that you've got to do. Should happen soon. One last, our last one started not long after the beginning of the year. It's great. You'll get to leave school and have so many adventures and learn wherever you want. I guess you could say our journey to become a champion was the treasure I found. <laughs> Maybe. I don't know yet if that's the answer I'm looking for. Anyway, I got a feeling that's going to be even stronger if you and I were both working at it. Let me go ahead and save the gym locations in your map in case you decide to go for it. Man, everyone's phone case is so cool. I got a basic red phone case. Whoa. That's... Oh, man. They all look strong. Okay. Victory Road. Oh! Is that... Oh, wow. Okay. I guess this is just what I gotta do. Give it some thought. Okay. I guess... Call me Master Wizzy to Director's Office, please. Oh, God! Once again, Master Wizzy to Director's Office, please. Oh, no. What did I do? I didn't do anything! Did I? Oh, boy. Well, I guess that's it for now. Thank you all so much for watching. If you like what you saw, be sure to subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next video. Take care, and good bye.